Hey, this is uh, Will Martin, and I just wanted to show you uh, some of the changes I made to the chassis today. I was working on uh, adding the back part to the chassis, so I used uh, just a smaller, it's about half the size of this block, and created sort of like a tongue and groove uh, that mated the two blocks to each other. Uh, so that creates the back part of the car that I'm planning on uh, creating brackets and such to mount. This is the electric motor here, and then this is the rear shock for uh, the rear swing arm. And then looking at this, uh, the way I had it before with the batteries, um, I have 26 batteries here, uh, and before I had them sort of laid out on the floor, uh, it was 13 in a row. Um, and then I guess I had six or seven on each side here, uh, but it was making it so that the driver had to be much further back in the car, and it was making, when you looked at it from the side, it looked way too long. Um, it just it just didn't seem as compact as, as what I wanted it to be. Um, you know, trying to keep the car simple, keep it light, and that means keeping it small. And so what I did was I decided to create uh, sort of a stacked battery pack here. Um, I haven't gotten around to creating the frame and making sure that these are all sort of uh, enough length away from each other to allow me to run the cables uh, down this middle part here. Uh, that's sort of the next step. But um, I just wanted to start throwing in some parts just to show what this would start looking like as a real car. Um, I also put up here, this is a steering uh, rack and pinion, um, and the idea would be that I'd have a joint that would go up to here, and then uh, sort of a CV joint or some, you know, a transfer joint that would then uh, go to the steering wheel here, and then that would be mounted on a dash, which is part of a frame that will hold the batteries and, and also have the body over that. So. This is sort of uh, where I am right now. Um, it's starting to look a little bit more like a car, which is nice. Uh, and from here, I'm going to work a little bit more on getting the, the frame, uh, the upper frame so the battery's done, and then the rear frame that would hold uh, the rear suspension and the motor together. So this is, uh, this is what it's looking like. If you want to follow uh, my work on this, uh, just subscribe to my YouTube page or you can uh, subscribe at my website, which is uh, willmartin.com. Thanks.